Three, five, seven, four, eleven, two, one. <laughs> What's going on, nation? Whoa, whoa, whoa! Welcome to episode forty-five. If you are forty-five, if you are listening to this on SoundCloud, you yeah. can watch it on YouTube. You can if you're watch watching it. this on YouTube, you, you can, can listen, listen to it on SoundCloud. Special anytime. wave to the deaf people. <laughs> the deaf oh, the people. <laughs> You but are, uh, yeah. also the 30 year anniversary of Grant's Adventures premieres April 24th at midnight, so don't miss that. Uh, 24 of midnight! That's today, what happened! You know what happened 24 of midnight? Jesus was born <laughs> on December. <laughs> on December 24th? At midnight! But my Whoa. thing is April 24th. Oh, yeah, but you're like Easter Jesus. <laughs> I'm Easter Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm Easter Jesus. Yeah, like you know, I bring Jesus Easter. Hoo, hoo, ha. <laughs> Listen. Listen. Today, Holy I, shit. Today I brought is... a special gift. Oh my lord, look at this. We have gifts. We have Tim Hortons. Oh. Which is they're going under a really large investigation right now what by happened? the federal government. I don't know. I didn't re read into it. Donald Trump. I didn't care. But apparently they're taking a lot of money from people. They're really fucking people over now. Yes, you know today. Actually, you remind me something. Tim today is fucking... I talked to the guy who have a friend who who own Tim Horton. Yeah, and they're getting... and they fucking push him by. Some machine who make one sandwich for fifty thousand dollars, and they're he making said, every all... store owner spend like four hundred fifty thousand. Yeah, because he have to make this fucking stupid one thing, and he say, "Holy shit!" Yeah, Tim yeah. Hortons is really fucking. And you see these people who are for him. Listen, Tim Hortons is doing bad things to people, but they're also doing good things to people. You know what? Uh, let's let's before you say something. Since the Burger King bad Tim Horton, shit go down. Okay, but what's Tim, Canadian? Tim Hortons yep. is very supporting the Humboldt Broncos. I don't know if you know the Humboldt Broncos. Oh, everybody know, but we should explain what happened. If I have it written go down. On the, I, I can't believe that you go on the subject. There was a big bus accident on yes. April 6, 2018. The Humboldt Broncos bus crash... Happened on April 6, 2018. The coach bus collided with a semi-trailer truck near Armley, Saskatchewan, Canada. Can you Six, show a picture? 16 people were yeah. killed. 13 were injured. Terrible. So, for this week, there was Jersey Day this week. Yes, uh, yesterday. I NHL said. is yeah. helping with them. And also, Tim Hortons is well, I want to get your reaction you coming, coming, and coming. now you're fucking up a nice I'm trying to no, pay okay, respect Tim. to the Broncos and you walk away no that very so we are hard and fast with you families. can support the Broncos by going to Tim Hortons yes. and getting Broncos donuts all oh, the color which yeah all exactly money and proceeds go to the humble Broncos, and you can help them out by that. Also, I got Reese's Pieces Donuts because I want to try them. Yes. So you could go to Tim Hortons and get Broncos Donuts. That's beautiful. Which we're going to eat throughout the show. So this is my Broncos Donut. Yeah, you nice. could choose your Broncos Donut. Yeah. They're in the color for the hum Humboldt Broncos. Yeah. They had funerals today. Yes. Today? Yep, for some of the players that died in that crash. Yeah. And it's just a horrible thing that these kids were doing something that they really loved and enjoyed. And they were paid athletes living their dream. And it just shows that life is really short. Yes. You enjoy every moment. Because you never actually know what's going to happen. Yeah. So, to humble Broncos. Yeah, guys. And these are good donuts they're selling for these uh, Broncos. All right. Bum, 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 bum. First, should Heinz bring mayo ketchup to U.S.? What? <laughs> you I know, hear Heinz and ketchup, but what? Do you know the company Heinz? I have Heinz ketchup. Okay. They have a product. Yeah? What the fuck is this? 
chair is making this you, noise? You, you, you touching the oh, fireplace? I'm touching. Fuck. You're touching. Okay. I'm touch. Nope. Still making that noise. Um. Okay. So Heinz has a product yeah. where they have a sauce. Yeah. Where they mix mayonnaise with ketchup, and it's called mayo chop. Okay, so what? They're saying, should we... They're Basically, the company's asking people if they should sell it in stores and if people would buy mayo ketchup. Or do you like, know, would I you buy ch- mayo ketchup? I have to taste first. How does it taste? Do you have Heinz mayo? No, I have Heinz ketchup. But do you have mayonnaise? I do. Do you have a bowl? <laughs> do you mm. want me to make you... Mayonnaise ketchup and you try with your finger just like a little bit just squirt a little mayo and put a spoon of mayo in a bowl Did you hear yourself just now what you said what? <laughs> you have to rewind this why because they're gonna tell you what you just said What do you mean if you have a mayo, You're gonna squirt a little bit mayo mayo and, and, and put spoon of the mayo you make mel mel not ketchup that's what I'm saying. That's so funny for me. What do you mean? What's funny? Because you you're supposed to say mayonnaise and ketchup mixed together. Yeah, it's called mayo chop. Yeah, but you said put square mayo, <laughs> square mayo. Yeah, and put spoon of the mayonnaise on the top. No, which I is didn't. This, yeah, I said, that's why I was laughing. I said spoon of ketchup. No, you didn't say and ketchup. You say mayo, mayo. And I'm like, no, <laughs> yeah, watch on the. On this thing later. Okay, so, but I didn't. Yes, you did. I That's said, why I laughed. You have a bowl. Yes. Put ketchup. I know. Put you, a spoon of yeah. mayo. Yeah, but you said Mix and said ketchup. You didn't get it. You say mel mel twice. No, I didn't. Yeah, I have on the tape. No. <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> You're betting. <laughs> because see, I know you said that. That's what I kept picking up right away. I was still laughing. I have no idea what you're talking about. I literally said ketchup no. and grab a spoon of mayo, yeah, put before, it in a bowl. But then you explain again. Did you have a little, just put a little mayo? Ketchup no. and mayo. I didn't say you have mayo, put mayo. I didn't say that. <laughs> Stop it, because every time you didn't say that, this Listen, happened. you have a very good track record of not listening. <laughs> so... Anyway, are we going to do this in the program? No, I don't know. Okay. Yeah, ne- next could, one? We could do it. You could try it. Would you buy mayo ketchup if you could literally just mix mayonnaise and ketchup in a bowl at home and use it as a sauce? Would you buy it already mixed from a store? Or you could buy the two separate and mix them together? But they always fucking mix them in a sandwich. I always have mayonnaise. I always have ketchup. I always have mustard. Yeah. Like, oh, this three always go together. Always. That's what I'm saying. They want to make it all in one. In one bottle. You just mm. buy it. Mm. Mayo chop. Mayo chop. Al Pacino. What? <laughs> you say Al Pacino? El Pacino. Listen. You can have another donut. Oh, fucking. We're not going to eat it because we're just chomping. <laughs> Which mean we know talking and people in the clouds thinking what the fuck is going on? What do you mean? We are talking though. He's fucking shovel the freaking donuts to himself. Yeah. Tomorrow we're gonna be 200 pounds more. No. <laughs> what they do- I that- took such a big shit at work today. At work? This morning I weighed 195.6. Oh nice. I ate lunch what? and breakfast to Morton's. What? Morton's. Took such a big shit. Okay, we're eating. That's I weighed. Nice. You're not eating. No, you're literally choosing not to eat the donuts I bought. <laughs> no, you sure. don't want to support Broncos. I eat Broncos. You have to eat the Broncos. No, you can't make fun of Broncos. You gotta eat the donuts. I you eat the, support them. I eat the donuts. Yeah, okay, you can have one more. Okay, we we'll just choose yeah. So I can eat some. But uh, I took the biggest shit, where I went from one ninety five point six. To 193.8. And I ate twice. Oh, and I almost lost two pounds from my shit there. That's awesome. So I was two pounds lighter. I went to the gym today. So I'm not going to gain weight. And I'm more more weight. 
So that's good. Because... You finally gonna hit two hundred pounds, or are you yeah, I'm not going trying up. to do that. Anymore? No, I'm going up because that's what's always how I start working. I eat regularly. Mm -hmm. and we uh, had a race to see who could hit two hundred pounds first, just between us. Yeah. And I hit two hundred pounds yeah. first. He was. He had seven months to gain five pounds. But now. Listen. And he couldn't gain five no, no, pounds in now, seven months. Now you're gonna be 200 for the next five years. But I'm already less than 200. Well, how much? I literally just told you how much I weigh. Yeah, but you bounced. I just you say told you. 200 to I just and 196. How much do I weigh? The 196. No. One See, that's what I'm saying. You don't listen. 190. Oh. Less? I told you my weight. Fuck. I just you said, said to what before washroom or after washroom? After washroom. Oh fuck, I didn't hear how after washroom. Yeah, exactly. Because you have a donut because in Because you think I'm saying mayo on top of <laughs> yes, mayo. That because, you said that. No, you're just proving that you don't listen. Oh, Shiha. Stop said, eating donuts. I said I weigh 193. Oh, that's nice. <laughs> now you're just hearing it? I just told you that two minutes ago. But I say 192. No, see, you're saying a different number again. No, 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 I know you say 193, but I said I was close. No, you didn't even say 192. You said 190. Two. No, you <laughs> literally said 190. But I said 190. You're not gonna eat this donut. Fucking <laughs> stop <laughs> eating shit. I'm gonna eat it. Only for me. Fucking don't eat your fucking. I'm gonna have the Reese's. I'm gonna try the Reese's Pieces donut yeah, right now for the this. first time. Yeah. Okay. That looks fucking good. Holy you're shit. You telling me you don't want that fucking donut? You're fucking crazy. That's a I was thinking you know, it's sweet. <laughs> <laughs> Every fucking time. So much sugar. Fucking now he loading. He's he gonna have a heart attack soon. Anyway, it's awesome. Well, today, yeah. Today's sugar day. <laughs> fucking. I want to support. Sugar. We honey, need honey. to support. And the donut's not gonna kill me because I shit like so much weight out today. Yeah, very nice. And I ate pasta and breakfast sandwiches. Oh my lord! We're gonna listen to this freaking food shit. Come on! Let's Next go. fucking uh, subject! Will Ferrell's in the hospital. Yeah, I see. He flipped his CV. <laughs> <laughs> Greatest comedian alive. Got in a huge car accident in California. Fucking they don't know who drive over there. He's in the hospital. I hope he gets better because... That's... He was okay. They was loading him fucking on a stretcher to the ambulance. Yeah. And he was on the phone on stop with somebody. Yeah, is that true? Or are you just no? I just see up? on TMZ. Yeah. 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 Very nice. But Will Ferrell. What's your favorite Will Ferrell movie? Elf. <laughs> that was a good choice. It's Santa coming. <laughs> Do you like it because Will Ferrell's in it, or you like it because Artie Lang's in it? I think he's not on Elf. Yes, he is. No, it's not. Yeah. No, it's not. He was in a different movie. Not with this. No, look it up. On Siri. Ask Siri. Was Artie Lang an elf? No. Yeah, ask Siri. He was in a other movie with... He played he... Santa Claus over no, there. No, he was the Santa's helper in the mall in the movie Elf. Sure? Yeah. Hey, Siri. Artie Lang was playing in the movie Elf? Christmas, Elf Man, The Elf, Elf Bowling the Movie, The Great North Pole Elf Strike, The Elf and the Robot, Elf on the Run, or The Happy Elf. That's Hotel? Elf. I found eight movies for you to choose from. Elf, Elf, Buddy's Musical Christmas, Elf Man, The Elf, Elf Bowling the Movie, The Great North Pole Elf Strike, The Elf and the Robot, Elf. Okay. Uh, Arnie Lang. Sorry, Peter. I don't really know. What? I don't know. You really. don't, uh, what? Uh, what? <laughs> <laughs> Jesus, what now? Trying to find out if Artie Lang was an elf. Yeah. I think he was. I'm pretty sure he was. Ba, 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 ba. He is typing on his phone, looking for the movie Elf. Trying to find out if Artie Lang was in oh, it died. or not. Artie Lang did not die. He did not. He looks like a fat motherfucker right now. He, oh, he's he's on older than me. One year. Yeah, and he looks fucking rough. Woof. 
Yeah. Rough. Rough. They had him on uh, Jim and Sam's show, already was on, when? like probably like seven months ago. And he had fucking like staples, like by his fucking here. They had to do like some surgery to suck fat out and oh, shit. Oh, okay, okay. Guys, like. Did he lose weight? No. He didn't lose I don't think he knows what a vegetable is. Because okay. I don't think he eats healthy at all. He's like. Really not a healthy person whatsoever. Well, his drug addictions don't help him that much either. Because, uh, well, he talks about it all the time. How he used to do, like, all the... There's my snow owl. Your snow owl? Yeah, we have snow owl here. Unbelievable nice. Really? Yeah. How come you didn't take a picture of it? fucking always quick. Disappeared from... Before you pull oh, the fork. Yeah. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Who? Who? Not you. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Did Are you he... find it? Funny? No, I don't see nothing. Okay, funny. type in elf. <clears throat> Just type in elf. Okay. Like the movie. Just elf. So he is right now typing elf into his iPhone. What were the results when you typed in ELF? 2000, okay. 2003. Okay. Movie. Okay. Right? So if it, if yeah. Elf into yeah. Bed, yeah. Yeah. Click it. Okay. You should get, have the list of the cast. Yeah. Will Ferrell, Will Ferrell, Will Ferrell. <laughs> Will Ferrell. Where's the cast list? Producer, we're starting. Will Ferrell, James, this, 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 no. Will Ferrell, James Cameron, it's not, he's not there. He was in different movie. He played like Santa Claus, Dirty Santa or something like that. But he never was there. He no, never. That's had... Billy Bob Thornton or whatever his name is. That's, yeah. That's uh, Bad Santa or whatever. But he was with Arnie over there. Mm. Arnie was there, dead. So you think he was in that movie? Yeah. Go to Dirty Santa. He's there. Dirty Santa. Da, 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 da. All right, so I have the list of the cast for Elf. Okay. Movie. All right. All right. Yeah. Peter Dinklage was in it. Peter Dinklage. He played an elf. Who oh, I know him, Peter Dinklage. Yes, he is the big guy, and Artie Lang played Gimple Santa in the movie Elf. So it was Artie Lang. Show me, he's there. Right there. You see his name on oh, that yeah, cast list? Yeah, he is Yeah. He was in the movie. Cause I know my shit. Okay, you're right. Yeah. Artie Lang, because I remember it's Artie Lang. It's the funniest scene because it's Artie Lang, Peter Dinklage, and Will Ferrell. Okay, so he all was dressed him. up as Santa characters in a mall. Yeah, that's it. Doesn't get any more funnier than that. Yes. Yeah, what's well, just your favorite movie with Will Ferrell? Step Brothers. Oh. Is one of the best movies Will Ferrell's ever done. You ever watch it? Yeah, yeah, I'm thinking the best movie boats he ever hose. done is boats now the hose. new shit with the one Mike Wahlberg and, and how he was in the jail with Kevin Hart oh, and he the movie he did with Mark Wahlberg that's like a long that, time ago no, too. No, but the new just came second one with Mel Gibson. Oh, Gitchen. that's with the Daddy's Home. You're yeah, talking but, about that one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And with Kevin Hart, how he was a rapper and he won. He, he prepared Kevin Hart, prepared him go to the jail. Get hard. Kevin Hart. Yeah, yeah, that was the movie, Get Hard. I don't know, Too Hard or he, we talked about Hard. No, that's literally what the movie was called. Oh, okay, okay. Wait, so you don't remember what the movie no, was called? No, I, I didn't remember. Well, I just watched it on Netflix. Yeah, <laughs> but we watched it here, I'm pretty sure. No. Yeah. I watched it by myself. Are you sure? Yeah. I definitely watched it with someone. Oh, maybe you, maybe you, yeah, you're right. Maybe here, because we always watch movies. Because I remember the one scene in that movie where he gives up and he's just like, you're going to learn how to suck dick. And Will Ferrell's sitting at the cafe and it's like, he realizes it's like a gay cafe. Uh -huh. And he's like, I don't want to do that. Looks like you're going to be the bitch in prison because yeah, you can't yeah. fight. It was a funny movie. Yeah, watch it. It's a funny movie with Kevin Hart. But now the Kevin Hart have the big tour called a responsibility. Irresponsible. Ear. Ear. No, not ear. <laughs> like I R R, like irresponsible. Oh, like ear. No, not ear. Why do you keep pointing at your ear? 
because there's no ears involved because, <laughs> with irresponsible. But it sounds ear. It sounds ear, but it's not ear. See, like for people on the SoundCloud, what you hear is not what you think you hear. It's different. <laughs> what do like you ear is not ear. It's irresponsible. It means like he is responsible for something. Mm, yeah, it's irresponsible. Or he is not responsible he's, for something. No, yeah. No, he's irres what is irresponsible. What is irresponsible? You're giving someone a responsibility. Yes. So I say yes. to you, yes. don't rip this paper in half. And I ripped it. And then you say, okay, no problem, I won't rip it. Yes. And then randomly you just rip it. But because irresponsibly. There you were being irresponsible because you weren't watching. Careless. You were watching. That's not careless. Yeah, like you didn't care. And you rip it. <laughs> Even yeah, you say you don't know. But you can also be it. irresponsible. Yeah. Also like that's... where they say like babysit my kid. Make sure he doesn't get hurt. No problem. Who? Kid? <laughs> you let the kid go outside. He trips and rips his knee open. Oh, now you have to put him down. Yeah, now you gotta put him down. <laughs> okay. Kill him! Then you're irresponsible. But Will Ferrell's best movie was uh, Step Brothers. And Tyler Giga Knights with Ricky Bobby. With him and Sasha Baron Cohen together as NASCAR drivers. Oh, yeah. That one is that a really funny. good one, too. I just want to pray for him. Fix his render. <laughs> I want to pray life. for my sponsors, Pizza Hut, KFC, Wonder Bread. Wonder Bread. Thank yeah. you for this awesome dinner. <laughs> yes. Yeah, it was fun. That's it from your fucking shit? What do you mean? Well, how many points you made? I didn't even flip the page yet. Oh, fuck. Okay, next subject. No, what? You don't care about Will Ferrell? No. What the fuck? I don't really care about Will Ferrell. He's a fucking... Do you know how much money he makes from his movies? I don't care. You don't care? No. You know, if you they work... said every hundred dollars yeah. his movie makes, he gets fourteen dollars to himself. So he basically have twenty eight dollars in the bank. So if it, no no no, <laughs> so if it, his movie yeah, 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 know, makes a hundred million, he gets fourteen million. Nice, good good. That's his pay movie? for his movies. That the only good movie he have is Elf. Every fucking winter gonna play. And he have residual check and probably everything. Yeah. Yeah, that's nice. But they play his other movies on TV, too. Mm, I haven't seen nothing else. Yeah, they no. do. They definitely play Step Brothers on TV. Sometimes. They maybe. definitely play Talagiga Nights. Talagiga Nights? With Ricky Bobby. Yeah, Ricky Bobby. Yeah. Well, who's in that movie? Ricky Bobby. Uh, who's in it? It's Two Will, guys. Will Ferrell. Yeah, and who? We just I just said his name. Ricky Bicky. No. The... Guy, <laughs> Sean Con Con uh, Borat. Yeah, Borat. Yeah. <laughs> Bar yeah, Bar Bar Bruno. Bruno. Yeah, very nice. Yeah. yeah, that's that's movie good. Yeah. He he lately fucking his wife making movie, but not him. Sasha Baron Cohen. Yeah, he had a new movie coming out again, some kind of comedy. His wife is hot, the eyes of his. Oh, shirt. now she's old. Like, now she's still hot. No, no, she's red, she's hot. In the movie The Joneses, where she makes out with Gal Gadot in that movie. That's fucking a good scene. Where they oh, go like the in the yeah, yeah, change yeah, 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 room. Yeah, 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 that was nice. And Bobby Lee is the. But see, Gal Gadot? Yeah. What's she... wrong with her now? You don't what? think she's hot? You're fucking insane. No, but she have this hotness. What you know, you you know. You can't see on anyone else. No, 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 no. You don't understand. Like it's there, but it's not really like hot, hot. She's like a. It's a. No, no. Let me finish because I'm gonna forget. Okay. She's like this other actress who nobody cares now. Uh, Jessica Alba. Mm -hmm. It was exactly the same. She was hot, but not. Hot like you wanna like be crazy about her. She, they like they both the same. Uh, thing. They're beautiful. They're there's beautiful, a but they're not hot enough yeah. to me. Be like wow. Yeah, I know what you mean. Cause there's like hot people, beautiful people, and gorgeous people. Yeah. And then you. Which you, you can you tell them, about me every day. Subject. I'm gorgeous. I'm hot, gorgeous, and beautiful. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> Do you remember how much I weigh? Oh, you was just fat before. Now you're gorgeous. What do you mean? It's been 
31 weeks I've been on this diet. Yeah, I see. Well, can I, That's you almost one year. Karaka? How much I weigh? Come on, memory test. 192. Three. Yeah. Yeah. Because I remember you scream 192. Now it's, uh, no, it's three. Yeah. And you're 27 years old. No. <laughs> I put your number on your heart. That is fake news. Mm. But, do you, okay, I have a question. Oh, fucking go Ready? for it. Yeah, okay. Do you, I can't wait. Do you know what Backpage.com is? Backpage.com. It's like on the back of the book. But it's a website. <laughs> yeah, like a call, Backpage. What do you think what you would find on Backpage.com? Everything what is in the back pages. Which is what? Like, whatever, something behind. What do you mean? What would you find? Oh, like, probably, like, how much hair have it, uh, uh, Jessica, Jessica Alba under her armpit. Like, it's stupid stuff like that. Yeah. What do you mean stupid stuff? Like, fucking crazy stuff. Like, back pages stuff. Yeah, but, see, you can't even describe what's on a back page. Like what? Do yeah, you, but they have the symbol, you like have the two to fingers, explain. and like this. That's back page. Explain what? But you give me example, so I tell you that's what I was thinking. Okay, they they like it's a website where you could promote and sell a service. Promote and sell a, a service? service on of what? What do you think? Like a sexual service? <laughs> <laughs> yes. So what the fuck can you promote? I'm not promoting! It's I'm news! I'm nipples and I'm selling each of them. Backpage.com is famous for just going on the website. You can find a hooker anywhere you are in the world. Message the hooker. Hooker shows up at your place in 15 minutes. <laughs> Everywhere in the world. Anywhere in the in world. She's in China. You in the fucking duck fuck... Uh, no, you literally go on Backpage.com. Yeah, and they're gonna find your and the closest say, hooker. Yeah, yeah the closest hooker. Yeah. You type in, like, I want hooker. Yeah, fifth, from, five minutes away from, from you. Yeah. Uh, like, if you're, like, in Toronto. I want hooker in Toronto. Why you say the name? Because they're in the news. Who? Backpage.com. No, but why you say the Be name this beautiful city? Of Toronto? Yeah. Because it's a Canada city. We, we live in here. Yeah, more, more, more. What city we live in? What do you mean? You have your stupid iPhone yelling half of the time what city we're actually in. On really? the show. Hey, yeah. sorry. What city we in? No. Not a good idea to do that. <laughs> anyway, so but, what they, so basically it's like a, like a porno site. Uh, not really. It's like... Girl, service one. It's like girls go... Go, go. They make like their own page go Daddy. on the back yeah, page. Exactly. Not GoDaddy. Yeah, GoDaddy is completely different. Yeah, the service. You know, no, it's so. not. GoDaddy is a website to help you make a website. And go... Back pages. Back pages make Is when you're a 19 years old girl uh -huh. who's paying 20 grand a year for school. Yes. You make a post saying, I will fucking suck for $150 an hour. She goes and fucks and sucks six times that night, makes a thousand dollars that night, and then she does that for ten nights a month, makes ten grand a month, and then she's making a hundred thousand dollars a year. That's terrible. Side, that, that's pay for school, pay for the rent, have a car, no worries, just gotta suck and fuck. And that's what back pages. Oh, uh, next subject. What do you mean? I didn't even say why they're in the news yet. No, for I, fucking, I, I fucking, was, we we know what's going on. They plead guilty. No, finally. First time. What? To human trafficking. What? You mean they transport hookers in a school bus? <laughs> no, human trafficking. Yeah, they bring. Is forcing girls to have sex with people against their will. Well, well we know what this. And means. out of. Everywhere in the world, you can use Backpage.com. Where's the only place in the world they get charged for uh, human trafficking? Canada. No. I Thailand. Give, give you a hint. It's in the States. But it's only in one state. California. No. Alaska. No. 
<laughs> Human trafficking in Alaska. The fucking bear was calling. Fucking hooker in Alaska, suck my dick. <laughs> the, bear, the bear is like, yeah. Fucking how did dick? Yeah, it did. She's complaining about hairballs. Yeah. And yeah. she cough balls like a cat. She got <laughs> hair balls. Yeah, hair balls, yeah. yeah. Oh! So anyway, so where is this was? In Alaska? No. What state? Where okay, they, I have the 50, only state. I have 52 states to go. Yes. Let's start. Let's start. Arizona. No. So we got three down. <laughs> <laughs> Michigan. No. That's that <laughs> Just think of a state like where, where in the middle of the mile. No, what? just think of a state yes. where the state is so crazy yes. and free to do anything you want. What? <laughs> that there's just a bunch of cowboys. Texas. Yes. Very nice. Texas is the only state where the, where the guy got charged for human trafficking. Oh. And then he got charged for mm. money money laundering. What? In California. You washing money laundering? <laughs> no, money laundering means you, you don't know what money laundering is? Everybody know. What is it? You have to find something, flip the money so it look like that's really money coming from something. No, I want the definition. Yeah, that's what I said. Money laundering. That's not the definition. It's money laundering is basically you're uh, corrupted something, you do it illegal, and then you have to do it look like it's illegal. No, it's you make money off a product, Yes. but you don't account it. You don't bookkeep it. Yes. You keep it as cash. Yes. And, and you move it and where? you shift it See, around. That, that's what I'm saying. You have but to you make this money. you don't put it in a bank account. Yeah. You don't put it anywhere. You just have it in cash going laundry, like in a circle. Yeah, it's going to the places would look like it's making money. So you're this making money. money. Yeah. But you're not accounting it for the government, so you don't have to pay taxes on it. That's what money money laundering is, and that's why it's illegal. Hawaii, Hawaii was Hawaii was a long time ago in this. I'm not gonna say which country, mm -hmm. but we figured out how ma magazine laundry doing. Mm -hmm. Basically, what happened is we was the guys. Who distributed all magazines like Playboys and everything to all city? Okay. We was the guys who counting how they coming from printing company. Okay. We separate for every Seven Eleven everywhere, mm -hmm. and then we go. Yeah. And this magazine was very expensive. We had ten dollars per magazine. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And every guys have inventory mm -hmm. in this Seven Eleven, so he know how many he have. How many he sell and then if he no sell he's sending back mm -hmm. but have to be how many he's sending back so we was sitting over there with my friend and we fucking make millions of dollars just figure out how we can do that so what happened is in a scenario let's say you order corner your store order 25 playboys mm -hmm. So he put this 25 plates with display, yeah? Mm -hmm. And sometimes it was the inspector who's coming and announced to your store and do, uh. I do inventory run away. So yeah. it's everything legal. So he counting every... It's, they're shutting down 7-Eleven. Okay. And they say, we're counting everything. What the fuck is in the store? Okay. So we're going to see nobody laundry magazine or something, yeah? Okay. So what happened? We figured out how they think and count. So let's say you order 25 magazines. Mm -hmm. So we and my friend thinking, okay, we're gonna bring to this guy. Oh, and how you, before I forget, how you returning, they counting not by the number, they, they counting like a recycle, they waiting and says to recycle. They no counting anymore how is magazine called, just he said how many he sent back. Okay. And then they just wait and to recycle. Mm -hmm. 
And I have a friend who working in a weight room. Mm -hmm. And I have a friend who distributes everything. And we have a friend who delivers everywhere. Mm -hmm. And we have a friend who's selling in the stores too. Mm -hmm. And we say, fuck me sideways, we can make a lot of money. And they say, how? And I said, here you <coughs> go. Are you ready? Mm -hmm. Are you ready for this fucking this international trip? <laughs> And then they fucking shut down the place after we left. Mm -hmm. What happened is, you're going to the store, who the guy ordered 25. Mm -hmm. you, you're walking to him, and you're saying, I give you 50. But you're just marking 25. And then you're selling this, another 25, and we split cash. You give it me 70%, you can keep it yourself 30. So for every playboy you're selling, you can have a third, uh, let's say every Playboy costs $10, you have three bucks for every Playboy. Fucking some spots, 7-Elevens, Playboys like, go like that. Yeah. Some spots, they can go like that. Mm -hmm. Villages is something people know by. So what we did, we grabbed from the spots what not selling, we steal from them, we shovel, shovel to these guys who's selling, mm -hmm. give them 25. Even we figure out you can sell 25 uh, uh, Playboys, let's say Playboys, mm -hmm. in fucking one hour. So if even inspector coming and he start counting everything, mm -hmm. all you have to do, take this money to your pocket. Because if you he start counting money, and the, let's say inspector show up, boom, and he start counting, and you sold already twenty six, mm -hmm. which you sold one from this original packet, and then inspector say, oh, okay, we're gonna do recycle. There twenty five which you sold out is undetectable, mm -hmm. and you say that day, oh, I just only sold one, or so not busy today, and you cover. So this guy. How they figure out this? Unbelievable. How you sending back what we did? We buy like a standard magazine who calls one dollar. Mm -hmm. We buy selves. Mm -hmm. We go to the village. Now we load over there so much for the village. It's it was so funny because village have twenty five people and they. <laughs> <laughs> 250 newspaper a day. <laughs> it was crazy. There was so much <laughs> information. They really wanted to read. Yeah, this guy. Yeah. <laughs> we coming. How we unload to him so much. So then we coming back to his place. Okay. And we buy, actually buy. So he got the money. <laughs> Show it to inspector. He actually sell 250 newspaper every day mm -hmm. but for these 250 papers when we sold we never go to him we just give him money mm -hmm. so he put and he says see he sold out okay so what happened that was our coverage over there so we grab these newspapers we hold it so how we return we say we return playboys but it wasn't playboys it was this newspaper it was 10 to 1 price mm -hmm. so we waited and go to recycle and the guy who working in recycle we pay him three dollars per every fucking newspaper everybody happy everybody make money and he mark over there there was playboys <laughs> it was freaking big circle we was the lady coming to me how i was responsible i was Counting every to every store. I have like 70 fucking 70 7 mm -hmm. and I put money and everybody oh who want to make money and she said oh my god You know my rent is go my daughter is sick and I give you a few extra uh, Playboys to your store so you can sell it and I have some money sure <laughs> we fucking Make everybody happy mm -hmm. Grab freaking packing too. You see it, it was unbelievable one day one day we're coming we go collecting because delivery ten on between five o'clock in the morning to seven delivery. Mm -hmm. Then we collect money. How we finish working? We work all night and we walk over there ten o'clock and we collect money ready from this store. One day we coming, fucking inspectors came like crazy. 
Mm -hmm. And the guy, the guy said, go away, go away. I'm like, oh shit. Because we have a signal, like, you know, like, uh, if I ask something and he says, Do you have a newspaper? And he said, oh no, everything is gone or something. Uh, twice today, maybe tomorrow. So we know the fucking specters on the back of the, his uh, counting. Mm -hmm. and, we, and we back off from that day. So everything was okay. Next day we're checking, everything is fine. He just count and everything working out. Never was too many. Mm -hmm. We always make sure it's possibility he's selling. So, so it's unbelievable. I tell you, was everything was covered. Mm -hmm. We we beat up the system. Say that. Yeah, it was unbelievable. But well, tell me, ask me. I tell you from right your away. math. Yes, I give it like. You it know, sounded like you were making like seventy five dollars a day doing that. No, from one store. No, no, no. You going to the train station? Hundred Playboys in yeah. one hour. Yeah. Because the people go everywhere and they buy. Yeah. There was very hot magazine, who you have to wait every two weeks. So you'd make thirty dollars from those hundred. No, if you have a hundred magazines, you sell them ten dollars each. That's a thousand dollars. And you said it's ten dollars, thousand dollars, ten times ten. What well, you don't know how math working? It's ten thousand. Are you retarded? It's a hundred times ten. Yes. Yeah. No. That's one thousand. That's one thousand. One thousand. Yes. After yes. you make three hundred dollars from the thousand. Why? What do you mean why? That's the seventy percent. I said we no, made. you didn't. We you give said three percent. We have three percent. Thirty percent to the three percent no, no. to you. Three percent to that guy. Three percent to the fucking no, 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 no. where maybe the I recycling miss, no, no, place. No, no, no. I said seventy percent go to us. Seventy percent. So how can the guy get three percent? No, and no. Then you seventy percent. Three percent. Seventy percent go to us. Listen. Yeah. 30% go to the salesman. Yeah. From my account, now yeah. I don't know distributing. I have to pay the guy 2%. Uh, yeah, that's what I'm saying. Two pr not 10%. 2%. I have 70%. So I'm losing. I have still 60%. After I pay the guy who's sitting there, the guy who's sitting there, the guy who's sitting there. Okay. Plus, how we supposed to return... Mm -hmm. The guy say, I'm uh, not, not going anymore. So we grab from here, we travel to the another place. Mm -hmm. Two days later, and he got it now. Mm -hmm. But going back, we have to buy this newspaper so we can wait. And he have wait because then they have a truck who leaving and have to be exactly amount how he wait this recycle was in the truck. So we mm -hmm. have to put fat Joe inside, <laughs> mm -hmm. so he made weight, yeah. or something, but it was unbelievable, you know, it was a lot, it was a lot, trust me, a lot, when you, mm -hmm. I give you an example, when you make $300 a month, and the magazine has $10, this was unbelievable money for us, mm -hmm. So you only make three hundred dollars a month from it. You make two hundred a month. No, that's not. That's every two weeks. Eh, no, so six hundred. No. no. Oh fuck! I forgot to say. This was one magazine. Yeah. It was car magazine. What was going next day? They, yeah. But they always it was weekly, and they was yeah. jumping. So I didn't send just Playboy. I yeah. have Playboy, Maxim, freaking everything. So for every day I make money in 30 days. Yeah, but you chose only one magazine every day. You didn't do all five in one day. They going five. That's because if you, if you, this guy say, oh my God, I can't sell anymore. So we run over there to him. Yeah, you're just pack, shifting. No, we pack this. Yeah. We go to different place where he, he where the guy say, I saw that yours and my inventory. Yeah. I have a room. Yeah. So the next day we drop to him more. Mm -hmm. And he, if you inspector coming, he gonna say, "Oh, I didn't sell it yet since last week. I forgot." It was always we have to always have a backup system. What we gonna say to this guy if we? 
mm-hmm. in the trouble. So that's what I'm saying. Was non-stop money going. Mm-hmm. Was non-stop working. We was just sitting over there. We was like uh, w- DiCaprio, <laughs> throwing money. We have so much. Mm-hmm. For us, that day was unbelievable happiness because we figured out. And guess what? In three months, mm-hmm. the Russian system uh, switched. Poland went crazy, and they closed this. Beautiful place where we distribute this, uh, and now everything went go private. Mm-hmm. Like they have yeah, company. Like government. Right. No, we was government. Yeah. And government was destroyed before, but now we screw up government, and then everybody go private and no more bullshit. Mm. So yeah, but the, like I say to you, we was covered. It was not just I give you example with one magazine, so yeah. you can see it. But it was unbelievable. It was big operation. It was city operation. Mm-hmm. See, size of the Toronto, and uh, an area like Mississauga and everything was non-stop going. Everybody was happy, money, 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 money. Mm-hmm. But we ha- the one point we get to over there, we became like, oh my god, that's getting too big. Mm-hmm. And I say, oh shit. And you know, t- many people know mm-hmm. somebody's quirking and then get the trouble. Mm-hmm. So we. Right on the end, we started shutting down everything. Even the people came to me and say, "Oh, can you guys sell?" I mean, we know they busted this guy. We don't go. We started lying, like the trouble on the end. So we basically fade down mm-hmm. our operation right before government make investigation. What's going on? Mm-hmm. With this company government, why don't they make money? Blah 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 blah. But the main thing was on them. The distribution and everything was so crooked. The government didn't receive so much money. Mm-hmm. And on the end, <laughs> where is the place? Why we have just said this news? <laughs> mm-hmm. Yeah, but there was already meal and big meal and everything was recycled. That was freaking amazing. Yeah, amazing. And uh, we're just, and you you end up doing a talk show. Uh, no, but that after. was that was like a, my youth. Yeah. Like we was you know in country where is no future, no internet, no nothing was just was mm-hmm. magazine. Our my, my our internet was magazines. Yeah. Bravo. Uh, like with music. Uh, then we have uh, Burda. Like there's this fashion from German, very popular magazine. Mm-hmm. Women was crazy because what they do in this magazine, mm-hmm. they they make a f- we couldn't buy fashion, mm-hmm. but they make uh, what do you call <laughs> like you, you you pull out this like a cent- pop up cent- <laughs> yeah centerpiece okay but you have everything. How you cutting yeah. and you cutting this and okay. then you can sewing. That was your blueprint for your dress. And the woman couldn't build up from this fucking magazine dresses. All stars. There was complete showing. But they told you what material you needed. Everything, yes, right? everything and blueprint. How you cutting, how you okay. sewing was amazing magazine. Mm-hmm. So that's why people want it. And this magazine was coming every two weeks. Holy macro, we was ordered like we was like a make of this magazine. Mm-hmm. Look like in my city, every woman village, <laughs> every kid dressed up like freaking Dol so, Cabana guy. Do, what? <laughs> Versace. Versace. Yeah, yeah. Germani. Uh, Hugo Boss the guy. Yeah. yeah. Holy, we have everything made by Polish guys through a magazine. <laughs> Big news in Portugal today. What the fuck? We talking about All fucking right. business model and you talking in Portuguese? They have no fucking electricity yet. Portugal. We're not talking about Puerto Rico. We're the same it's shit. It's not. Portugal is European country. Really? Puerto Rico. Hey, Suri. What the fuck are you? Hey, Suri. Portugal is a European country. Oh, they are working after seven. And guess what they speak? Portuguese. Brazilian. No, Brazilians speak Portuguese. I know, fuck <laughs> Jesus. So in Portugal, yeah. the government has a there's a new law in Portugal, which is you could change your gender now. 
in Portugal. It's the first country to do it. They said it's groundbreaking for government, everyone. You can change your gender on every document, everything, birth certificate, everything in Portugal. So, citizens from the age of 16 will now be able to change their gender and name in documents without the need of a medical report. So, if I woke up in Portugal, and I was from Portugal, yeah, I woke up the next morning. Without penis? No, not without penis. I just wake up and I'm, I'm like... two penis. I say... I feel like a woman today. I'm a woman today. And my name... I'm so pretty. And dancing. my name is... Granchina. Godzilla. No. My name is Godzilla. My name is Lonnie. I'm a woman. My name is Lonnie. So I could go to what like... What kind of Lonnie is woman? Man? Lonnie. <laughs> yeah, what? Ronnie. You know, like, Ronnie. 69! Yeah, exactly. Okay. So, so anyway, you won't be woman. So I know this I wake gonna, up. I know this won't happen. <laughs> I wake up. I decide in Portugal, because I'm a Portuguese person, I want to be a woman. And I could do this at 16. Yeah. So, like, I could be halfway through school. Yeah. Like, high school. Yeah. I could go yeah. to the head office, <laughs> like, the government office. Yeah. Oh, shit. And... I'm gonna be like, I'm changing my gender to woman. Yeah. And my name is Lonnie now. Yeah. And the government goes, okay, fill out yeah. the paperwork. Thank you, Lonnie. Yeah. Have a good day, Lonnie. Yeah. How long we can record today? Like an hour. Can we go over? Most we could do is hour four. What would happen if you want to cut off something? What do you mean, cut off something? That's shit. <laughs> we it? can't cut off. Then we have to do a completely different no. show. Why? We're not cutting. No, we have to cut this. What I said, that's going to be hit me in the ass if somebody hears this. Then we have to restart the whole no, thing. No, why? You just cut this off no, from how I start talking. No, we and have now to we... restart the whole thing. Jesus. No one's going to bite you no, in the ass. No, fuck. That's go Trust me. This is going to bite me in the ass. No. Yes. No. Yes. Why? Yeah, I don't know. What do you mean? You're just getting paranoid now. Yeah, because I'm thinking I will reveal so much... And that's going to be... If it happened over 30 years ago, they can't track nothing. It's only 29. <laughs> that's what I'm saying. It's so long ago. Yeah, but like, can and you... That... Why do you argue? I just don't want it. But that government doesn't exist yeah, anymore. Yeah, that's what's... Yeah, exactly. So what's but the that, problem? But that's... It's just a story that you did at your youth. Yeah. You want me to tell a bad story to make you feel better? No, 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 no. I don't want to know about the bad story, but I'm, I worry about these people who was working and related to this and now they're going to hear maybe by accident this. Yeah, so? They're not doing it anymore. No, no, no. That's You're not doing it anymore. No, but basically what we you did... You literally listen. said it last three months, no, which no, no. is nothing. Yeah, yeah. But basically what I was doing, I was doing like today, marketing people doing. Yeah. And I had no, to you were pay doing, myself for this business. You were doing business. proper business. Yeah, you we shifted, figured out. You shifted magazines <clears throat> where it wasn't selling. To the... You took them because they were going to go in the garbage anyways. Yes. But instead of putting them in the garbage, we you to the resold place. them to a store. Yes. So Because you know that store is going to sell them. Yes. And you took a piece because yes. you're reselling the these one, magazines. One store said one week over there yeah. and they have to return it. You're but one store selling in one day. You're basically like a repo operation. Yes. That's like how repos work. <laughs> Person buys the car but can't pay for it, so you come take it and then you give it to someone else that could sell it and make sure someone buys it. Mm. And you take a piece from it. I don't know. That's I don't how know. it was. Okay. That's all you did. But anyway, so that was yeah. We was that was begin begin of the marketing and everything. What we was figured out what these people should do that. Yeah. We basically figured out this and it was yeah. like because before it was nobody care. Yeah. Because everybody have the same money, equal yeah. pay. <laughs> yeah. And a freaking yeah, do you work or you no know work, you have the same money. Hey, yeah. Yeah. But if you want something extra, you, you couldn't do it because there's nothing to do. Yeah. And then we figure out we can have extra if we put a little effort to shifting everything. Mm -hmm. Which was 
Magazines. <laughs> yes, but which was that time no no. Yeah, but that time like that government, that country ruined my country. Uh doesn't exist. No like, no no. So like Soviet Union doesn't exist anymore. Yeah, it's Russia still there. But that's not Soviet Union. Wait, hey, next topic! Yeah, I was talking about Portugal. And then oh, you I think you take Portugal. Fucking spaz attack. Port no, 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 because I was thinking. Because about probably half of those people are dead. Yeah. Anyways. Yeah. So it doesn't matter. Yeah. What's my sunglasses? Like. <laughs> I will be freaking, uh, uh, you know. There's uh, breaking news. I got animal news. What happened to animals? Because you can't. You say you want to do animal news. So there's. Who died a, this time? Oh, uh, there is a picture or video. I think it's a video though. Of a whale sneezing a rainbow. That's gasoline? No, not gasoline. Because usually gasoline. It could be color, gasoline. Like, like, like rainbow color. Maybe it's a BP oil spill whale. You're something. Like how he kicked. So the whale, it's a humpback whale. He's in the water in California. And he shoots water out of his hole, yeah. and it sounds like a sneeze. Yeah. But the guy gets it on video and on picture when he sneezes, a rainbow appears out of his hole. Oh, that's and shoots that's, to the sky. Yeah, but that's uh, so he sneezes from a the rainbow water and this crystals. That day, the position of the but sun. But you know how go... rare that is to see a whale sneeze a rainbow. Like that's rare. Yeah. Yeah, okay, so that's your breaking news, the back you, well thing? Yeah, what, you don't like animal news now? No, that's you good. You said you wanted animal news. No, no, but news. what's the name of the well? There's no name, it's just a humpback whale. Oh, that's, that's it? That's the name. A white, yellow, woman, man, what, you don't know? calf, It's not from Portugal. It's not from Portugal, so the whale cannot what ca did change they, its they, gender. Did, did the marijuana is legal in Portugal? Portugal is the only country where every single drug on the planet is legal there. No, no kidding, you see a rainbow fucking bag thing jumping. I'm pretty sure it's the only country. Oh, the look at this whale, he's sneezing rainbow. Yeah, but I said the whale was seen in California. But why did you say Portugal? Because you were bringing up. What's yeah, but the you whale, said that news was woman, not in, the whale was not uh, in Portugal. No, because you were trying to make a joke saying the woman whale or guy whale or yellow no, no, whale. No, 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 no. And no, I no. said it's not Portugal because they the whale can't choose its gender because they just passed the gender law. The that whale was, can choose the gender. That's what the joke was. Oh. But you don't listen. No, no, no. But they get it. So the yeah. whale won't be woman. No, that's not that. The joke was that. <laughs> no, I know. Yeah, you don't get it. No, every time I'm confusing you because how you talk. Yeah, but it's all over the place. Yeah, and you don't even know what you're talking about. It's all Which over the place. place. You're talking. <laughs> Which place? Which I'm not talking about any place. That's right. <laughs> See, I pick it up. What? What you said? Yeah, but you don't even know what you're I picking. I know, but. I, that's so funny, you don't understand? I always pick it up somewhere and you run away. No! You're fucking having a panic attack about magazines that don't Why exist. Why you bring this back? <laughs> that don't exist anymore. Anywhere. You can't find Bravo. No, no, they have Bravo You still. can't find Duchindag or whatever the fuck. Yeah, Burda. Burda, yeah. Burda. 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 Yeah, the big woman for two and a half minutes. <laughs> can't find Burda nowhere. Giorgio Armani, Versace. Yeah, Hugo Boss. Hugo Boss was that's ridiculous with this fucking. And finally, <laughs> oh my god, let's. <laughs> Khloe Kardashian had a kid. Yeah, she had a boy. She had a girl. I don't know where you. What were. name? Boy. I don't know what the name is. Was we'll say George. It. No, she had a fucking girl with the basketball player. Oh, his tapes came out. Which. He cheated yes. on her while she was pregnant. No. Yeah. I think it was before. No. It because was, the sex tape It was wild. Because it said on TMZ. Yeah, TMZ. Three months, I think, into her pregnancy, she found out that the guy was... The fucking, Canadian guy? Was fucking and sucking other people. That's, that's, that's terrible. What do you mean? Why you can't be with one woman? Listen, There's no trust anymore. Guys need to fucking suck. I and if understand. the girl doesn't want to fucking suck, 
Then there's no point on oh that. Oh my god, why I even come back to this? There's no shit. point on that relationship. There's Venus no point of even Venus having a relationship because it seems like the person doesn't want to have a relationship if they don't want to keep fucking and sucking. And that's how. How's your and then that's, personal relationship going with sucking? Right? I said you could watch a rant with Grant live on YouTube oh, about you my Tinder story. date. <clears throat> yeah, that's one Tinder date. Yeah, that I had on uh, Valentine's Day. So yeah, that was like two months ago. That's nice. Yeah. <laughs> this is what it's, listen, this is, guys need to suck and fuck. They got to blow their load and sometimes a rainbow shoots out. Yes. Okay, so what more with animals? animals? What do you mean? That's it. That's it? That's the show. Oh my god, I'm going to jail. <laughs> uh, you want your donut no, finally? Wait, or can you, you just leave it? We can eat later. Later, I'm going home after this. No, we're watching movies. I'm not watching anything. I come home. I'm coming over later. I'm going home. <laughs> what later? Later, like uh, on the <laughs> other day. <laughs> oh. oh. You know? Listen, do you have some joke? No. Come on, say some joke. What joke? Ask Siri, tell you a joke. Hey Siri, tell me some joke. I couldn't figure out why the baseball kept getting larger. Then it hit me. <laughs> That's funny! Yeah. Hey Siri! <laughs> hey Siri! <laughs> hey Siri, tell me joke. Two silkworms challenged each other to a race. It ended in a tie. Do you get it? No. The silk worms, they oh, okay. bind together. No, so Wait. they end up in a tie. Okay, I know. Hey, Suri, tell me a joke. What did the Buddhist monk say to the hot dog vendor? Make me one with everything. I don't get that joke. That's a horrible joke. Wait, one more No, the last one. Oh, hurry up. Tell me a joke. Steak? That's a rare medium. Well done. Ah, that ah good. that's funny. Alrighty, everybody. 30 year anniversary episode goes on April 24th live at midnight. It's in Jesus' name. You can watch, uh, you can listen on the SoundCloud and, and, watch on on your and watch on YouTube. Yeah. And also, bang, 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 bang. What? Out.